Hi guys, James here from Hayes Machinery and today we're going to look at Nugent's smallest trailer in their range, the quad trailer. And although it's small, it still packs the punch of all of Nugent's special features and benefits that you get from any of their other trailers. It's just smaller. So I'm going to talk you through all of those now. Although this is quite a basic trailer, you start with the bare bones of it and then build it up with the optional extras as you please. The main one is the tailgate on the back. This is the full tailgate with optional lamb door on the back. So if you've got sheep in the back of the trailer, you can let single ewes or lambs out individually rather than having to let the whole tailboard down at once. The other option is to just have it as one full ramp tail door, which you let down like so. It's a full aluminium checker plate back on the tailboard. Aluminium checker plate floor is an optional extra. Otherwise it will come with an 18 millimeter plywood birch floor in the bottom. The Nugent quad trailers as standard come with the 22 by 11 by 8 tyres, which are the knobbly grippy tyres for off-road use. And also the axle through the bottom is a full beam along the bottom of the trailer, rather than just being a little stub axle welded to the frame. So the optional high sides on the Nugent quad trailer are all removable so that you can use it as a low trailer as well for things like fencing or other operations around the farm or equestrian property. They're very easy to remove, just got two lynch bins here on the end. And it slips in on the back with a nut or bolt on the end there, which holds it tight. Slacken off that bolt there, pull out on the front and lift out. And the sides come off very, very easily. The same with the other side and the front of the trailer. You then got the option to be able to use this trailer for fencing or other applications because you can reach in from the side of the trailer and get things out. But for livestock, you've got the higher sides to be able to put on and off. The Nugent trailer also comes as standard with mud guards on both sides. So another optional extra is the lamb divider in the front of the trailer, which could be stored there in the front. And then when you want to use it, you just literally slot it in to there on the trailer so that you can put your lambs at the front of the trailer and then you use behind at lambing time. So the Nugent quad bike trailer is fitted as standard with a 50 millimeter ball socket very easily. Comes off of the back of the bike and back onto it like so. So as you can see, we've removed all of the sides from the quad trailer, so now you've got really easy access to the whole trailer to be able to do that. And you've still got full use of the rear tailboard to be able to drop that down and push a wheelbarrow in or something like that. So although they describe this trailer as a six foot by four foot, the internal dimensions are 170 centimetres by 135 centimetres. That's 67 inches by 53 inches. So there we have the Nugent Quad Trailer. If you've got any questions or queries, please do not hesitate to give us a call. Otherwise, pop in and have a look at one for yourself. Thanks for watching.